Hello everyone. In my last video, I teach you how to create EC2 instance and uh, install Apache server on it. So in uh, today's video, uh, I will sh uh, show you how you can uh, clone your instance and uh, relaunch uh, it. So let's get started. Here I am in my instance dashboard and you can see here uh, my instance is up and running. So uh, first I will show you the page of uh, Apache which I installed uh, in my last video. So here you can see this is the default page of uh, Apache server. Now it's time to clone our instance. For that, uh, we will uh, click on Actions, and uh, here we will first create our instance image. Write a name, whatever you want. I call it as a server B, and uh, in description, uh, this is for testing. So there you go. It's time to create our image. So successfully, our image has been created. Here you can see uh, it will take a while for uh, available status. Now you can see here it's uh, pending status. Now you can see here uh, this is uh, status is available so it's time to launch instance from uh, AMI. Here we will name our uh, clone instance. So in my case this is for just testing so I will give it name as testing server. Here you can see the image that we are using is uh, our last instance image that we used in uh, our last tutorial. Instance type is also T2 micro and the uh, key pair I will use my last key pair. In network setting uh, we will use our security group that we created in our last video so this is my security group that I created in my last video so this is it it's time to launch our instance now uh, it's uh, it has been successfully created it will take uh, two to three minutes to uh, say status uh, passed Now you can see the status is passed. Now uh, if you copy your public IP and paste here and uh, you, can, uh, you can see the page default page is showing. Uh, it's mean our instance is uh, successfully cloned. So this is it for this video. Hope you guys uh, enjoying my content. Uh, for any question please let me know in uh, comment box down below and keep supporting uh, thank you so much for watching